Hello everybody, what's up, what's up YouTube? Anyways, I like to talk in this video that's been on my mind for actually almost a year. But I never actually speak this out so freely. But this one I will talk on um, woman, American woman mainly since I'm living here in America. And, um, fake numbers. And let me get straight to the point. I hate it. Let me just say this. Like probably I'm gonna start when I first was kind of like dating. So probably like when I was a teenager, you know what I'm saying, young teen to um to officially dating at 18 years old. So basically, like a couple years since I was pretty much like 11 to 18 and all that. I kind of realized too that at least I'm gonna say back then when I was first starting off dating, at least the chicks was so was feeling me. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Like back then when I was, you know, even it was kind of bad then too. I'm going to be frank. But truthfully speaking, I'm going to say this anyway. But at least they seemed like they was kind of real when they gave out their number. Or either either they were telling you like it is. Either they were feeling you or they was not feeling you. Or in some cases, they give you fake number. You know what I'm saying? Now I'm switching almost like I ain't been dating almost near since five, uh, five years now. I've been trying to talk to chicks, you know, for just trying to get to know them so to see where their mentality is at. And boy, today's chicks, I kind of don't blame my dudes acting like complete assholes, man. I kind of see why um, brothers and men alike treat women like dog shit, you know what I'm saying? I, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get to that. And see, like, you know what I'm saying? It's quite funny. I mean, like, on the so called online dating, just, you know, just try, not even online dating, just. Basically, um, just trying to get to know these chicks in general to know where their mindsets is at. It'd be quite funny that sometimes we'd change numbers, right? But as soon as I started calling them, then they, they had the, part of my language, they had the motherfucking audacity to get mad. I'm like, come on, man, you gave me your number. Most of these chicks be giving their numbers, and they had the fucking audacity to get mad at me? I mean, you know what I'm saying? That's like to me, you invite me to your house, they get mad, they had a nerve. Um, disrespect me, you know what I'm saying? I mean, you know what I'm saying? You gave me your number, you, you idiot, dumb, retarded bitch. I mean, for real, or real man. Sometimes I, I, I give out checks my numbers at times, you know, this, and I really um, feeling them or be interested in them and stuff like that. Just to see where their mental state is at. And boy, I like, also like, we don't last no more than a week or two, and all of a sudden that we lose connection and all that, or, um, or some odd reason, like, you know what I'm saying, they be, they don't respond to my texts, they don't respond to my emails, my calls and shit. I mean, I can take a no, you know what I'm saying, I can, um, take no. I can handle rejection. But my God, I, I for one, and shall not, and will not ever do, I will not tolerate bullshit, man. You know what I'm saying? How dare y'all women today want real dudes, I'm speaking American women, how the fuck you want real dudes? You don't even deserve a real dude on the real, man. A lot of y'all chicks today don't even deserve a man. Let me just be frank. I mean, if you ain't feeling a woman now, at least tell him no beforehand. You know what I'm saying? Tell him, or if you ask you, if you ain't, if you ain't feeling it, you, you can take a note. Even somewhere. I'm, so there's some dudes out there I've met that can't handle rejection. But I will tell you, this one fact I can never tolerate is lies and bullshit. You know what I'm saying? As nothing I will never tolerate is lies. You know what I'm saying? I tell bitch, tell bitches in the heartbeat, if you ain't feeling me, I can take a note. You know what I'm saying? That's cool with me. Don't go around and try to get all brothers hopes up and shit. Don't go around and try to get them all, like, anticipating your ass. And then I'll try to shut them down afterwards. You know what I'm saying? Like, like soon you after y'all try to introduce and talk to each other. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm not feeling you. Oh, I'm sorry. You know I got a boyfriend. You know, oh, I'm married. Oh, bitch, you should have told me at the beginning. When I be looking at these chicks pages and shit like most of this shit up, they be polar opposites all so I'm single, I'm available, I ain't got no kids and shit, but soon you start talking to them, they bunch of lying pieces of shit. You know what I'm saying? I kinda see why dudes I I might have I might have just say something for the brothers today. I kinda see why you do treat women like dog shit. I kinda have to see why. Cause women today they don't appreciate dudes. They don't, they don't appreciate Jim. Then when they do, they treat them like complete dog shit. Sometimes myself personally, I, I really get angry. You know what I'm saying? I get pissed off over this dumb shit. You know what I'm saying? 
I mean, bitches and they just downright fake, man. You know what I'm saying? I mean, if you ain't feeling the brother, let a brother know. Don't go around and get his hopes up, man. Don't go around and get him all excited, all hype up. Oh, man, like, you know what I'm saying? Girl, I'll take that initiation. Like, okay, cool, dude. We might, you know what I'm saying? Like, how am I supposed to get to know somebody if I'm being shut down? That's like trying, um, having a job, right? As soon as you might get approved and get a job, all of a sudden they might lay you off all of a sudden. That's kind of almost like the same view I'm trying to look at with chicks. How dare you try to so called accept dudes or get up, whatever the number, whoever give out first. But yet you had the audacity to shut a nigga down? Fuck out of here, bitch. Bunch of dumbass bitches today, man. That's all I gotta say, man. Peace.